Hey guys, I'm LB, and as you can see, we're going to check out Mandatory Power, if it'll load. That took a really long time to load, but let's see here. The description, the description says, Heavily influenced by a previous test of mine, this test is my entry in the first Remake Me competition of 2017. Note, the screenshot is not accurate. And also, we have smooth scrolling today. I think at some point, we didn't have smooth scrolling, and then at some point further back, we did have smooth scrolling, so smooth scrolling is back. Not sure what caused smooth scrolling to come back in Steam, but we have it now. So let's check out this flame tusk map. Right, let's just jump straight into it. Wow, this is big. Holy crap! It's been a long time since I've seen a map that looks like this. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't even know where to begin. At least we can get back up here pretty easily, but that doesn't have... Do any of these droppers have signage? What? Where's all the signage for this dropper? Is it on... Is it on the side here? No. Who knows where it is? I guess that dropper just didn't have signage. It must be optional decoration in that case. Hmm. What's over there? Okay, this is a place to be. This doesn't have any signage, so I'm guessing it's optional. This laser appears to never turn off. What?! Okay then. At least we can get up here now, but uh, yeah, that should really have signage. Like, even if it's right next to it, it should have signage. I can't remember what context this map was requested in, but maybe... I think Flamtusk might have requested it, just so that I could see how better his current maps are compared to an old map. I don't remember. I didn't make a note of it. What was the date for this? No, it's from this year! I might have be- I might be remembering somebody else requesting bad maps of theirs. What does this do for us? Nothing much. So we would need to come up here with a cube, I guess? What is that for? I guess that's... What would that be for? Maybe that angles to point in that direction. That'd be my guess. That is a long way down. Okay, well... What happens if I do this? Awesome, I'm over here now. What does this do? Oh, it just turned off that fizzler. Okay then. What about this? What? What is any of this for? Okay, so that appears as a result of me having pressed this button. But where do I need to go... next? There's a button up there. I could have done that a long time ago. Where do I even need to go, though? And why is that such a long... T There's lots of places where I can easily fall, so I don't know why I would need to do that. All right, let's just do this. I don't really have any idea what I'm doing. Nope, well, that's not quite what I wanted to do. Yeah, I'm up here now. Oh, this button with no signage goes to the dropper with no signage, huh? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Well, we have a laser cube now. Not sure what good it'll do us. Suppose we can hit that. What did that do, though? I mean... Oh! What? What? Why would I want that? What does that help me with? Absolutely nothing. What is even the point of that? Maybe I'll understand later? I have no idea. Right, well, let's just take this cube... upstairs, I suppose. What the?! Cube, no, why?! What?! Why did that happen? I 
I think these platforms can be buggy like that. Sometimes they can send cubes bouncing around for no reason. Let's see here. I don't know how that happened. What the? No, it happened again! Okay, um... I'm not sure what's causing that. But, I would very much appreciate it if it stopped happening. Okay. We did it this time. I managed to do it. Buggy game. What does this do? Ah, uh, yes, it does do that. Right, so, now that I've done that... I wanna jump... down here, perhaps. Get way too much speed to make this happen. Holy crap! Oh, and you want me to do that again, huh? Hang on a second. I can actually see that from here, you know. I don't need- I didn't need this intermediate step. <laughs> okay, then. Right. Square. Hey, that one actually has signage. Why didn't any of the others have signage? It looks weird how there's like a rim and then there's no rim here because this glass is on the outside. Freaks me out. <laughs> Right, well, we've got a cube there now. Might as well go get that now, I suppose. Hopefully we don't need maximum terminal velocity to make this jump. Nope, we do not. Excellent. Um... Guess now we just need to get to the exit, right? Seven blocks, that's really way too high to do anything with. That's... panel. So if we just get one cube over there... If we just get one cube over there... Hmm... I'm thinking about this. Right, so, let's go get the laser cube back. Oh, I need to bring this with me, of course. Because I need to swap it out. At least for the time being. I can get it back later. There we go. Now. Portal there. And... Portal... There. Theoretically, that should work. Maybe. I don't actually know. I don't know where this cube will end up, to be honest. If it doesn't go to the exit, I'm not sure what I need to do. What? How did that... What? Did I misjudge? Let's try this again, please. Where does that portal need to go? Where does the cube land? Yeah, the cube just lands there. Okay, so... That's not it. How do I get to the exit, then? Huh. Cause this doesn't get me high enough. Yeah, the exit's too high for that. So let's go get that laser cube back. And then we also need the regular cube back, cause I need to figure out what to do here. How do I get over there? Oh, right, I didn't even... Forgot that that even had an ant line to it. Right, well that makes things much more obvious as to what we need to do. And that bug's still in the game. Because why wouldn't it be? What possible reason could there be to not have that bug still be in the game? Thought I wasn't gonna make that. 
Right. There we go. I need to get the regular cube back after I do this. Ah, uh, no, before I do this. I'm not thinking things through clearly here. There we go. Let's do this. There we go. Take the regular cube back. There we go. Point this at that. And now we just need to get across. Hopefully this is enough to do it. Yeah, there we go. So then we just put the cube on the button there. And... oh. We're done. Hooray! There we go. We're out of here. <laughs> Well, that wasn't much of a puzzle, that was just more of walking around pushing buttons. Anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!